of days ago, I had a viewer send me an email and ask about changing a dog's name. Um, I've actually been asked this question a few times over the years and I thought it'd be a great video topic. Um, so should you change a dog's name? Um, there are some reasons that you should. It, a lot of times when you adopt a shelter pet, um, they don't come with a name because they're rescues, they come off the street or they've been abandoned. Um, and so they don't have a name and the shelter makes up a name for them. Um, in that case, you certainly could change the name because they probably haven't had it for very long and they probably haven't had enough training to really associate that that is their name. Um, dogs that were abused, oftentimes it's good to change that dog's name. He's getting a new start and um, sometimes, you know, abused dogs they've been yelled at, that name's been screamed at them, and that name can be associated with some negative trauma. So it can be helpful to change a dog's name in that case as well. Um, so should you change your dog's name? You shouldn't just change it on a whim if you've had the same dog for five years and things are going great and you just wanna change his name, probably not the best idea. But there are certainly some reasons why you could change a dog's name. Um, and it's actually pretty easy to do. Most dogs, um, you know, they come to associate their name pretty quickly. So it's it's, it's not typically something that's difficult to do. You want to, first of all, choose a name as soon as possible. It's gonna confuse the dog if you call them their old name for a few days and then switch to a new name. Um, if you bring them home from the shelter and you know you start off right away calling them their new name, then that's gonna help them to associate it faster um, rather than sort of getting used to that old name for a while and then trying to switch over. If your dog didn't have a name that he was used to before you brought him into your home, uh, say the name frequently and then reward him when he acknowledges you. You also always wanna say the name in a happy tone. Make sure that um, it's a positive experience when he hears the name, he's happy, you're happy, and when he recognizes it and looks at you or comes to you, um, you're rewarding that behavior. If he had a name that he was already used to, for example, the dog was in a traumatic situation, he was rescued from that, um, and you, know, you wanna now change the name now that he's in a safe home, you wanna try to choose a name, um, it's best and easiest, I should say, um, to choose a name that starts with the same letter. You certainly don't have to do that, but it'll make the transition a lot easier for the dog. Um, also, you can try mixing the names together in the very beginning. So, for example, if the old name was Jojo and the new name is Jackson. Um, so you're gonna call him Jojo Jackson to start off with. And for that first day or two, um, you know he's gonna recognize the Jojo and then he's gonna get used to that Jackson being added on to it. So for the first day or two, you're gonna call him the names mixed together. And then um, again, you know, rewarding him when he's recognizing his name. And then over time, um, you know, on that like third day, you can gradually start to drop the old name once in a while, but keep doing the mixed name for most of the time and then slowly just transition until you're using just the new name. Be sure to reward the dog every time he responds to that new name, whether it's mixed or it's all by itself. If he's responding to it, um, you wanna make sure that you reward that. And you can tell by the dog's response how fast you can move. You know, if he's picking up on it and really responding um, very well to the new name when you say it all by itself, you can move the progression along a little bit faster. If he doesn't seem to be, you know, registering that he's got a new name, you might wanna mix those names for a little bit longer. So, um, you know, observe the dog and uh, just make your own judgment on how gradual you should make that process. Always say the name in a happy tone. Like I said, you really wanna associate that name with um, this positivity and happiness so that the dog is looking forward to hearing his name and coming to you or, or looking to you um, once he hears that name. And uh, finally, my last tip is stick to the new name. Don't change it. So, you know, give it some thought, um, you know, before you bring the dog home or, you know, once you do bring the dog home, you want to make a decision fairly quickly um, and you could not use a name like Hey Boy or Come Here Girl, um, you know, for those first few hours until you settle on a name. But you want to settle on a name and then stick to it. So the training is consistent and the dog's not getting used to one name and then, you know, a few days later you're changing it up again. Pick a name, stick to it, do some consistent training, lots of rewards, and your dog will learn his new name in the meantime.